Hey, I'm gonna watch you down to a quarter tank. You wanna come up? Nah, I'll be fine. Can't be far. If you don't find it soon, I'm calling it. I'll find it. All right. Hey, I got something here. What is it? No rust, right color. Maybe it hit the rocks, tore off before tumbling. Hey, you're mumbling. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it looks like a piece of our wreck. Must be close by. You're teasing me now, Drake. You're teasing me. Ah, there you are. I found it. All right. How's it look? Uh, it's beat up, but intact. All right, here we go. <clears throat> there. <clears throat> Whoa! <laughs> Morning, fellas. All right, I'm in. Uh, looks like a lot of it's still strapped down. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, five. Okay, by my count, we're shy two crates. I'm gonna go round them up. Hold on. How about you come up first, get a fresh tank? Ah, the crate's gotta be nearby. I got this. Ha! <laughs> Found one. Ah, crap. The crate's pinned beneath the trailer. Tell you what. Secure the other crate first. Then we'll lift the trailer up for you. Uh, you see? That's why you get paid the big bucks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ray wouldn't have drifted this far. Ha! <laughs> Found the other crate. One down, one to go. Secure it in the trailer. We're nearly at your position. All right, see you soon. <sighs> this thing's getting heavy. Remember, only thing I want to recover from that riverbed is that trailer. That's one crate secure. Good timing. We're right above you. Sling's on its way down. Coming down. Okay, it's in position. Look up the trailer. We'll raise it up a bit for you. Okay, got the cable. Gonna try looping it around one of the axes. That should work. Yep. One. All right, you watch your oxygen now. That's fine. And 
That's two. Okay, trailer secure, ready to go. All right, get clear, we'll lift it up. Ready when you are. And up we go. Okay, that enough? Yeah, plenty. Just don't drop it on me. <laughs> no promises. Okay, I got the other crate. I'm gonna strap it in with the others. All cargo present and accounted for. Yeah, with five minutes of oxygen to spare. Jesus. Hey, maybe you should hang out then. See if you can find some other treasures down there. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Wanna ride up? <laughs> I'd love one. Let me know when you're on the sling. Okay, I'm in position. Get me out of here, will you? You got it. Going up. Uh-uh. Look at that beauty. How you feeling? A little better now that I'm out of that river. I'm gonna stink like fish for a week. <laughs> All right. We're gonna come to you. Hang on. Hang on. What's up, boys? Good to have you back, Drake. Yeah, it's good to be back. Toss down your gear. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. <sighs> Whoa, this tank's kind of light. I'm just making your job easier, right? My man. How'd we do? How do you think? Full recovery? Every last bit. <laughs> Making the rest of us look bad. Making the rest of you look good. Let's wrap this up later. My hero. <laughs> Come on, let's go see what you brought us. Hey, so how about you let someone else be point man next time? You've earned a break. No, no thanks. I'll take a dive over being at the office any day. Yeah, well, uh, either way, it's gonna be a while to the next dive. What are you talking about? What about Thursday's job? Mm -mm. Oh, come on, no. Got underbid. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, competition's tough. Let's see here now. Care to do the honors? Yeah, sure. Thanks. Wow. Look at that. We struck copper. <laughs> 
Well, you'd be surprised how much this stuff is worth. Client's paying good money for the full cover. Sure you don't want to just melt it down, make some pennies? <laughs> Come on, let's go celebrate. First round's on me. Bar hopping with you guys? <laughs> no, 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 not unless there's hazard pay. Uh, if it's all the same to you, I think I'm just gonna do the paperwork and uh, get home and crash. A rain check, though? All right, suit yourself. Hey, good work today. Thanks. Hey, Nate. Nate, hold on. Hey, what are you doing here? Uh, I got a present for you. Present? Yeah. What's this? I got some news from my contact about that wreck off the coast of Malaysia. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, the ship's intact. Yeah? Cargo's right for the pigging. You are a persistent one, I'll give you that. And all the money came through for the equipment, too. We are all set. Except, uh, my best guy. The guy I trust for the job, the only one, he, he's got cold feet. My feet were never warm to begin with. And tell me, this contact of yours, you get the permits? No, he did not get the no. permits. Can't no one get the damn permits? Of course not. But Nate, don't you see that works in our favor? No permits means no competition. The ship is ours. No permits means no go. <sighs> Nate, this is retirement money. <laughs> for the both of us, okay? I don't know about you, but I don't want to be working salvage when I'm 60. Do you? Sure beats prison. No. Listen, I have to pass. And trust me, so should you. Okay, just take it with you. Humor me, I'm okay? not gonna change my mind. Well, then don't hurt to sleep on it, does it? <laughs> Say hi to Carla and the kids for me, okay? All right. No pressure, Nate. But think about it. Really did your homework on this one. Narrow down the search area. It would make a hell of a find. Son of a bitch. <laughs> no, no, no way. You are going with the others. Bloom found in a German U-boat in the middle of a jungle. Who would have thunk? Climbed your big brother some years back. Francis Drake takes a bullet for Sully. Look at us. Shambhala. Miss you, pal. So Francis and his elaborate puzzles. Thanks for nothing, St. Dismas. <laughs> now 
this was a crazy ride. Hmm. Another lifetime, Chloe. Really, my style anymore. Yeah. Here they come. Take cover. I'm surrounded. Bullseye. Take that. Don't let him flank you, mate. And that. All right. <sighs> Gotta keep moving. Eat plastic. Back in business. Yeah, bring it. Gotcha. Like a pro. So long. That'll teach you. See ya. Yeah. Yeah, I'll be right there. Late time's over. See you next time. Wow. Now that is a good one. Is this what you're working on? Wow, we really need to go on another vacation. It's been too long. You were up there a long time. Well, I was researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. Oh, yeah, sure thing. Thanks.
<laughs> Done. Okay. Oh. Finish it? Yeah. Oh. You know, it's probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? <laughs> God, I'm starving. It looks good. Mm-hmm. Joe, how was your day? What? Hmm? Got none of that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm -hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm -hmm. I uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm -hmm. Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? Oh, it was a brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck we got. <laughs> Apparently the natives called it a semi. Oh, dear Lord. Kind of so, it's boring stuff. But tell me about the article. Well... It started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is gonna like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs, like the second that you got off the plane. So, I kinda took this Ah. What? Where are you? I'm in here, being stabbed with a fork. Oh, really? Uh, what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? what? This one? Flights in Bangkok that um, are having troubles with them because the smog and they can't land. Wow. All right, I'm sorry. No, it was valiant. It I was, was in the really ballpark, right? In a different state, but yeah, you were in a ballpark. <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. You know what? I don't want it. Really. I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not but worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't but seen him Elena, in about two years. Well, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Stop, I'll do them. No, you did on. them last night. No, you cooked. I clean. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me, um, uh, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Oh, wow. OK, cowboy. OK, watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning. Is this it? No, it has to load. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, there we go. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No, no, just, uh... How do you, uh... How do you make it go? Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera. Got it. And the circle button is your spin attack. Spin attack! Yeah, and press X to jump. Right. Which one's X? Yeah. 
right thumb. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. Use your spin attack. Oh, yeah, way to go there. Not bad, not bad. What is that thing, a fox? A bandicoot. Looks like a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Okay, smash the boxes. Why is a fox smashing crates? Bandicoot, and that's just, it's what he does. It's a fox, and it's not very realistic. Perfect. By the way, foxes can't do this. It's a bandicoot. That doesn't look anything like a bandicoot. Have you ever seen a bandicoot? Yeah. No, but I'm sure they don't wear sneakers. Okay, grab the fruit. What does the fruit do? A hundred gives you an extra life. A hundred? Who's got time to pick a hundred pieces of fruit? <laughs> oh, what happened? You fell in the pit. I don't know. How do I uh, climb back up? You're dead. Well, that's not realistic. I, I would have climbed back up. He should learn to climb. Climbing's always helped me. Uh, these graphics are pretty good, aren't they? Why is he stealing all this fruit? Foxes do not need fruit. He's not stealing, he's collecting. Well, it's not his, and that's called stealing. Huh, yeah, well, you would know. What's that? Nothing. I'm talking smack again. Stay focused. Oh, that poor fox. Bandicoot. Okay, agree to disagree. Last life. You gotta make it count. Oh, I so got this. Good, good. There you go. Okay, get the wampa fruit. What the hell is wampa fruit? Clear, it's a wampa fruit. Why does a fox want fruit? Watch that pit. Watch him. I watch him. Okay, good. Is that it? You asked for it. Oh. oh. You gotta be kidding me. I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good really? cleaning. Really? You're gonna start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier on no, Just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you gonna do? I'm, I'm warning you. What are you gonna do? I'm warning you. In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. You. What can you I'm do in real life? What do you think about that? <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? Um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. <sighs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner. Definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take <laughs> it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I, I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. Well, Nathan, we killed a guard, okay? So they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. Jesus, Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. You would have come back. I know, Nathan. I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. 
Hey, hey. You still with me? Yeah. Need some air. <laughs> You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. <laughs> it's a lot to digest, you know? But how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, right, right. Slow down. Hey. Have a seat. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. So what's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. Tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. <sighs> These were crazy stories. Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that, uh, that actually happened. Come on, man. What did I miss? Jeez, Sam, where do I start? Start with the best part. A few years back, I got roped into uh, breaking into this Turkish museum to steal this oil lamp, okay? Oil lamp? Uh, it was an artifact from Marco Polo's lost treasure fleet. Kubla Khan's treasure. Yeah. Yeah, and as it turns out, it was a whole hell of a lot more on those ships than just treasure. I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and uh, we made it out alive. Barely. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring, the engagement ring. I'm married. I can't believe, I, Elena from the stories, that's my wife. You gotta come meet her. Tonight, dinner, at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan, I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? What's the name Hector Alcazar ring about with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but uh, last year he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. You're not reading the night. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Uh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> well, I mean... They have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. No. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <sighs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can, but I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time, which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? 
<laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? The opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segmenta aquí. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Vámonos. Holy shit. <laughs> 